Everybody feeling it? You feeling it, right? Ready? All right, let's do something, all of us together. All of us together in this little pod. Let's take a big, deep breath. Take a big, deep breath, take it in, then just let it out. And remember right now, in this moment, remember why we're really here. Believe it or not, it's not about that gorgeous dress, the flowers, the hair, the suit, or even this beautiful day, and this really crazy high roller <laughs> observation wheel, or even the fact that some of you have come from as far as Vietnam, Philadelphia, here in Las Vegas, all coming to wish you well, to say we're on your side. We wouldn't miss it for the world, right? Plus, it's Vegas, baby. It's going to be a lot of fun. All those things brought us here together, but really and truly, it's only about one thing today. It's about that look that's in your eyes, that's all over your faces, that says we're in love. We want to spend the rest of our lives together, right? Let's go to Vegas and make it happen. We can do that here. That's what we do, right? And so you're inviting your best friend, the love of your life, your soulmate, to join you today for all that you are, all that you have, and all that you hope to have. And I know this. I know that marriage is really, it's really a covenant of promises, promises written on the pages of your hearts, a covenant that says, hey, I have no idea where this crazy life might take me. I just know this one thing, but I know it with all my heart. I want you to go there with me, right? Yes. Because life, come on, life promises none of us perfect health or wealth or fame, but the promises that you two make to each other in front of all of us are promises that in the best of times, in your moments of highest achievement, Randy, the love of your life will be there with you. She'll be there for you. And in the worst of times, right, huh? Same guy, the love of your life, he will be there with you, he will be there for you. And let me take those beautiful flowers, because right now I want you to face each other and hold each other's hands. That's right, just like that. And what's happening as you're holding on to your loved one's hand besides the nervous energy that, oh my gosh, this day is really here. We're really doing it, right? Right now, think about it. The love of your life is holding onto your hand with a grasp that says, listen, I'm your greatest fan. I'm the firmest believer in who you are and way more importantly, in who you can be. And so in your race to achieve your purpose, your goals, your dreams, your desires, your passions in this lifetime, guess what? You each will be that cheerleader for the other. Standing on the sidelines, yelling, go for it, you can do it. I believe in you. And oh, I love those four words. I'll say them again. I believe in you. Four simple words, but they're the most empowering words in any language when they're spoken by the love of your life. I believe in you means that person holding on to your hand right now knows, knows, knows the magnificence of you. Even when we don't know it for ourselves. Come on, let's get real. Every now and then our self-esteem gets a little bit low. Our self-worth gets a little bit shaky. But I believe in you means that person holding onto your hand knows the you that you don't show to anyone else but them and yourself. And they fell in love with that you. And I am a firm believer that it's our imperfections. And we all have a couple, even hang of it. They make us absolutely perfect. <laughs> perfect for another human being. So I've never been to a wedding where they didn't use that Corinthians verse, love is patient, love is kind. I love that. But you have to admit, we are the Corinthians of the 21st century. And if they were writing to us right now, they would be writing love is crazy, love is blind, because they had no idea about Facebook or Twitter, online dating, how the two of you could come together in Vietnam all the way across the world nine years ago and immediately start a relationship, start a friendship. This is what I know. Even though I wasn't there that day, there was a little spot of your hearts that was open just a crack to just beginning that friendship. It grew over time into a relationship. They grew over time in an exclusive relationship. And even though he was the first Westerner you'd ever dated, and that was kind of scary, I bet, and all these different cultural differences, plus the proximity of you living all the way across the world from each other, you overcame all of that because you were thinking, breathing, acting from your heart, which just tells us why things can happen. Instead of our very large brain, which tells us why things can't possibly work out. So every wrong turn, you thought you took. Every mistake you thought you made in life brought you standing here, holding onto the hands of the love of your life. Because if one thing had been different, none of us would be on this pod right now. So in my mind, there are no mistakes when you're on your authentic, divine life's journey. And this is the next chapter in that journey for the two of you, this next chapter called marriage. So with that in mind, I want you to speak these words to each other now after me. 
to have and to hold. To, to have and, and to hold. From this day forward. From this day forward. In joy and celebration. In joy and celebration. In love and understanding. In love and understanding. I pledge you my faith. I pledge you my faith. Perfect, perfect, perfect. Now the beautiful rings that we're about to exchange are symbols, right? They're symbols of an unbroken circle without a beginning, without an end, just like the two of you coming together today as husband and wife. And I know that's the big idea, but I have to say way more importantly, as partners, as partners for life. And may your love for one another just continue to grow and continue to be wise, pure, and eternal. Randy, take that beautiful ring, place it on Hong's left hand, and repeat after me, with this beautiful, very expensive ring. <laughs> <laughs> with this beautiful, very expensive ring. I thee wed. I thee wed. With a promise. With a promise. That my love will grow stronger. That my love will grow stronger. Throughout the years. Throughout the years. Perfect. On your turn. Place that ring on Randy's hand. And repeat after me. I give you this ring. I give you this ring. As a sign of my love. Of the sign of my love. With a promise. With a promise. That my love will never fade. Which, that my love will never fade. And I will always be as cute and sexy as today. Can you repeat again? I'll always be as smoking hot as today. <laughs> okay, I will take care of you well. Oh, okay. <laughs> I put that part in for Randy. <laughs> Very nice. Yeah. Do you have anything that you want to say to each other? I you love you, honey. Yeah, I Absolutely. love you, and I can't wait to be your wife, and <laughs> I'm so happy and proud of you. So I'm thank you. Too. Thank you for being with my life. Yeah. Thank you, honey. Awesome, awesome, yeah. awesome, awesome. Oh, wow. So cool. So what are we doing right now? I know we're rolling video and taking pictures and we're laughing and a couple of happy tears even there, here and there. But there's one more thing we're doing right now, believe it or not. We're all looking at ourselves, looking at them. We're looking at ourselves in a mirror, even though we don't look as cute and dressed up and emotional as they are. Looking at ourselves in a mirror of ourselves on our best day, our very best day. Because none of us gets any bigger or brighter or more full of love or hope or light, positive energy and grace than two people on a wedding day. Pledging what? Unconditional love, acceptance of another human being exactly the way they are. That's as good as we get. So when we're right now in this moment, we realize that we're all connected by that vector of love, of unconditional love, because all of that's inside of each and every one of us. We all have that same magnificence, that same capacity. So thank you for reminding us what makes this crazy, wonderful world go around. People like you falling in love every day. So right now I feel blessed that we're all on this journey together, this little circular journey of love here with the two of you. So I want to do a brief blessing before we wrap the whole thing up. So I want you to hold each other's hands and let my words become your words. I want to speak for all of you right now. As we say right now in this moment, there's a powerful presence in this little pod on the top of Las Vegas called love. In this love cloud, in this love essence, in this love atmosphere, we know one thing, and that is that your home is filled with nothing but joy and love and laughter, and patience, and kindness, and respect, prosperity, perfect health, and forgiveness for each other. We know all your friends and family, this isn't all of them, all that are here with us today, those that couldn't be here with us today, those that have gone before and shuffled off this mortal coil and are here with us in spirit as your surrounding angels are all given the strength to support you in your lifetime journey of love and life together. So let's just say thank you. Thank you, thank you, thank you for this absolutely perfect, perfect day that's been given to Randy and Hong on their wedding day, and so it is. Amen. And here's my favorite part of the whole thing. By the power vested in me by this wonderfully crazy, great state of Nevada, and you all admit it's a little bit crazy, it is my privilege to pronounce you finally, husband and wife, you may kiss your beautiful bride, Randy. Give it up for him again. Congratulations, you two. You make a beautiful, beautiful loving couple. Thank you so much for sharing your special day with all of us today. So nice to meet the two of you. There's one more thing we gotta do. I want Randy, give her your arm. Give her your arm. And just let her, let him walk her down the aisle. Just really quick here, we get a couple of pictures. Give it up for him one more time. Randy and Hong. That's right. Congratulations. 
Awesome. Yes. Now let's have fun.